Hey everyone, this is Aprajita back again from Excel Champs. In this video, we will combine our text giving a line break. Now we will discuss three ways of doing this. First is using ampersand with function called char. Second is using again the same function with concatenate. Third is combination of char which is character and text join. Now let's discuss the first method which is using ampersand with the character function which is also called the char function. Here I have an example. I have name, department and the city. Now we'll use this function. First of all, I'm going to use the ampersand function. I want to combine this and I'll use the function char 10. Remember, this is standard char number 10. And I want to concatenate this with the department. And again, I'll use this char 10 and the city and press enter. Now my three cells are combined. Now what you need to do is you just simply need to select this cell and use the wrap text option. Now you will notice my three cells are combined, but there's a break between three, the three of my characters, which is John marketing and Paris. Similarly, I'll copy this formula down and I got my cells combined. Now the second method of doing this is using the same function with concatenate. Now, all of you must be knowing that concatenate and ampersand are the same functions which are used to combine the cells. Now we will use the concatenate function. I will use the text one separated by a comma and then I need to enter my character function comma the second cell again the same function and then the third cell. In other words, this char function is just a space which I am utilizing to give a space between my cells. So when I press Again, the wrap text function, my cells are combined and there's a space like John is in the first line, marketing is in the second and Paris is in the third line. Now, the third option of doing this is using the char and text join function. Now here, let's go through the syntax of this function text join. Here I need to add the delimiter, which is like the char function here again. Next is ignore empty cells or I want the empty cells to be included when my cells are combined. So here I am entering two since I want it to ignore my empty spaces. The third is my range. Now I'll select this range since I want to combine these three cells and I will press enter. Similarly, I'll drag this down the formula and when I click on wrap text, again my text is combined but there's a break between all the three words in one cell only so i hope you like this video please don't forget to like comment and share thank you for watching